Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Recently, I came across Steve Mo's YouTube video about building a computer with water, and I learned that the most basic component in the digital circuit is logic gate. And I wanted to you build a machine that can use logic gate to compute too. And uh, logic gate contains AND gates, OR gates, and exclusive OR gates. In my plan, I'm gonna use AND gate and uh, exclusive OR gates to build a calculator. Okay, let's go. Okay, now let me describe exactly how this four either works. Firstly, I use eight logical gate ICs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And they are from Texas Instrument. Four of them are exclusive OR gates. And four of them are, these four are AND gates. So, and with the circuit diagram of my own design, like this. I connect the wire and ICs together and provide a 5 volt power through, the, through a battery to make, make such a calculator. Uh, and this calculator can calculate addition up to 31. But you may ask why within 31? It's because I have five outputs here, replaced by uh, five light bubbles. Uh, turning them all on, turning them on represents zero, and uh, turning them off represents one. So this calculator can only have five digital binary output. Yeah. However. 32 is 100,000 100, in binary, which means I can't see the output beyond the 32. Yeah, and uh, the light yellow wire represents input, and uh, the dark uh, yellow wire represents output. Mm, now let me do an experiment sh to show you that uh, this calculator really works and uh, doing well. Okay. Now let me show you how this calculator works. <coughs> um, firstly, let me unplug all the input pins, these light yellow wires. Okay. So. Uh, we use TI Inspire to randomly generate uh, two numbers. Uh, we press enter. We can see we got uh, five and six. Okay. Uh, the five in binary equals to zero one zero one, and the six in binary equals to zero one one zero. Yeah. So let me look at this board at first. We can see that uh, the power through the this wire to the board to these axis, and uh, we can see there's negative pole over here and positive pole on the right. In the circuit, uh, we can know that uh, the negative represents zero and positive represents one. So when we want to represent 5, we just need to plug uh, the pin as negative, positive, negative, positive. Okay, let me do this. The first thing is negative and then 
positive then negative then positive uh, for the same reason we plug uh, 6 as as negative positive positive and negative okay and uh, due to our common sense the 5 plus 6 equal to 11 and just look at what we got here yeah just like what I told you before uh, the light turning on refers to <coughs> represents zero and the light turning off refers to one yeah so we got uh, one zero one one here so it's just equal to 11 yeah perfect